hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel today's video is sponsored by best hair by and today i'll be reviewing their tea part curly bob and it has the standard wood construction of two combs in the front one in the back and an adjustable elastic band first try it on this is what it looks like this unit is not pre-plugged at all but since it's a T part and since it's short, it should be okay because I'm gonna just pluck this little portion right here in the front just slightly. And again, because it's a T part, you can't part, pluck too much. Well, it does have a little bit of lace in the front, so you can pluck, pluck it how you want. And I am going to go ahead and pluck this part just a little bit more to get it a little more defined. So let me just go ahead and go jump right into that. Now, since these knots are not bleached, I'm gonna spray some of this Sally Hansen spray just along the front of the unit as well as on the parting area to mimic the bleached look. I'm just going to take a damp rag and wipe any excess spray that got onto the hair. And now it's ready to be installed. And as you guys can see, I think this looks a lot better. And as I mentioned, only this part of the lace is going to show based on how I plan on styling it. So I'm not too worried about the size. If you want to style it with the side showing, then you could go ahead and pluck the size of this unit a little bit more. Now I'm gonna go ahead and cut the lace. Okay, she's starting to show a little bit potential. Not really sure how I'm gonna style this. I think I'm gonna wear this glueless. I really don't see any need to glue this down okay maybe i'll just paste down this area since i do plan on laying a couple of baby hairs i'm gonna use my guys to be glue insta hold mm, i lied i'm gonna just spray the whole thing now You literally don't have a lot of hair to play with since this is a T part. I'm gonna cut that a little bit right there. I'm gonna use my Faithfully Asia Beauty Wax Stick and gently flat iron this part and area to get it to lay a lot more flat. You're gonna press down at the back of the hot comb. I'm gonna take my curling iron and just try to put some of these curls back in this unit. I really should have curled this before I put this unit on, but um, I kind of like it. It's like a wild, untamed curl let me try and add some foundation to the parting area just to define that a little bit what do you guys think do we like her or not let me turn around and let you guys see what it looks like from the back. I don't even know what it looks like from the back. Fingers crossed. Clearly, I would need to curl this unit, but you can see its potential. But you can kind of play around with this and see how you prefer to style it. I do want to try and wet it. So let's go ahead and spray some water and see what happens to this hair.
a little water on the side. Okay, so I decided to add some mousse to the side of this unit just to give it more of a wet look and see what it looked like. It's a little wild and crazy look, but it's kind of like a messy hairdo. Let me see what the back looks like. Okay, at this point, I just decided to go for it and cut one side shorter than the other. Um, Guys, this is exactly how I am with my real hair. That's how I end up with it shorter and shorter. I think she has so much potential for you guys to style it however you want. See, I'm just playing with it. But if I actually sat here and got scissors, and I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just cutting. You ain't got to really know how to cut. Yeah, I got some long pieces in here. But what she's worth, I think she's a good buy. Okay, this is a totally different wig at this point. But you guys saw what it started like. Take a scissor and create your own. Got to be glue, kinkier, curling mousse. I really like the texture this hair gets when it's wet. I think I prefer it more than this dry. It's so cute. This wig is perfect for like the spring or something when you just want to do like a short curly do. Okay, so finally I just put the diffuser to the hair just to kind of tame the curls a little bit. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this one. Comment down below. Okay dolls, so it's a new day and for some reason I was just wondering how this unit would look if I straightened it. So I went ahead and straightened it. Not bad, not bad. What do you guys think? Y'all digging it straightened or no? Okay, I'm really interested to know what you guys think. Make sure y'all leave a comment in the comment section down below. So let me jump into the details of this unit really quickly. As I mentioned, this hair is from Best Hair Buy, and this is their eight inch short curly ball. As you guys can see, I turned it into a short straight ball. You can really just play around with it and do whatever you want. It's a human hair wig, so you really have a whole lot of options. As you guys saw, it went from curly to straight, and then it could go by curly by just simply wetting it. So it's so versatile, and in my opinion, it's a lot more flexibility than if you would have bought, a, say, a synthetic wig, because it's human hair. So I was able to secure a coupon go for you guys, and I will put that across the screen. And this is gonna save you a discount on this already affordable wig. Once you apply my discount, it's only gonna cost you about $40. That makes getting this wig a no-brainer it's only $40 it's not many synthetic wigs you're gonna get for $40 and you have so much more flexibility because like I mentioned this is a human hair wig so guys if you are interested in purchasing this unit as always I have everything linked in the description box down below if you're watching on your mobile phone just click the arrow to the right of the title and the description box will appear but before we get out of here guys I'm gonna need your help naming this unit what do you think we should call her? <laughs> Go ahead and leave your name suggestions in the comment section down below. And I did pick a name for the unit I reviewed last week. The new name and the person who submitted that name will be listed across the screen. So dolls, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you're not part of the Faithful fam, go ahead and hit that subscribe button before you leave. And as always important, until next time, you guys stay blessed. And if it be God's will, I'll see you in my next video. Take care now.